Hey guys, Sock here from Sock e Tech, and in today's video, we are going to be talking about a feature that every Samsung Galaxy S23 owner must enable. Enabling this feature will make sure that if you ever lose your phone or if your phone gets stolen, you will be able to track its precise location and retrieve your phone instead of taking a $1,000 plus loss. Using this feature, you will also get access to a powerful command center, which you're looking at right now, that will allow you to erase all the data on your phone remotely and much more. So let's dive in. First, let me show you how to enable this feature and then how to use it and all its capability. All right, so here's what you want to do. You want to go to the settings and then you want to scroll down into security and privacy, tap on it and then scroll down. And here's the option I'm talking about. It's known as Find My Mobile. Basically, if you ever lose this phone, you are able to track its precise location from any other phone or any computer. And on top of that, using this feature, you can remote delete your phone if you're scared the person might actually hack it. So I clicked on Find My Mobile and you can see it says, allow this phone to be found. And right now it is not set up. So what you do is once you're in this area, if it is not set up already, you click right here. Then you're gonna see this menu. Now you are going to be logged in with your Samsung account. This is the same account that you're going to use to locate this phone if you ever lose it. So here's the option you want to enable. Again, I'm going to show you how to enable it and I'm going to show you how to actually use it. So let's enable this thing right now. Now once you do enable these features, you also want to enable a bunch of these features based on your needs. This is the remote unlock feature which allows you to unlock your phone remotely if necessary for any specific reason. So if you do enable this, it's gonna give you a quick info on what it actually does. For example, this allows you to unlock your phone remotely and actually control your phone remotely if that is something you ever need. Now if your phone gets stolen, you're not gonna need that so in this case, I'm just going to keep this cancel, but it's an option. Now this one right here is the send last location. Enable this guy. It is going to keep sending the last known location of the phone to you. It's going to go to the Samsung account and the associated email. Now this one here is one of the best options. This is an offline finding option. So let's say somebody stole your phone, but they have the phone set to offline mode meaning it is not connected to any network. With this option, if you enable this, it is still going to allow you to actually locate that phone even if that phone is not connected to a network. This is an amazing feature and you should have it on if this is a concern to you, okay? By default, this should be always on, but then you can turn these on based on your needs as well. So once you set all these things up, let's say your phone gets lost. How do you actually locate it? There's a couple ways to do it. You can do it on your friend's phone. You can do it on a laptop. You can do it on a tablet, doesn't matter. What you do is you go to this URL right here, smartthingsfind.samsung.com and you log in with your Samsung account. Now let me show you how that works on a computer as an example. All right, so you can go to any computer, PC or Mac and launch any browser. And the first step would be, you would type in this URL. You can write this somewhere down in case you forget it. So once you plug this URL in, you're gonna be at this website. This is Samsung Smart Things Find website. So the next step would be to sign in. You click sign in, you're gonna put your username and your password. And once you do that, you're gonna be dumped onto this website right here. Now there's a lot of stuff going on here. I'm going to show you the most important part. So the first time you log in, you might see this tutorial that says, welcome to smart things find. It'll tell you what you can do and all that stuff. And behind here, uh, the blurred area is actually a map of exactly where your phone is. Now, in my case, I just blurred this out for security, but I can click on this get started right here and I get the full interface as you can see. Now with this interface, on this side, you can ignore mine. You're going to see a lot of products listed here simply because I run a reviewing channel here. So there's going to be a lot of products, but you're going to see all your existing products, your Galaxy Watch, your Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra, or any other Samsung product you might have 
will show up on this corner right here. But the actual control panel that's the most important is right here on the top right. And you can see you have several pieces of information about your phone. It tells you what's the current battery life of the actual phone. It tells you when that information was updated, at what date and at what time. And you can always click on refresh to get an update, which I did just now. I'm gonna get an update in a couple of seconds here, as you can see. So let's say you lost your phone. The first thing you can do is you can click on this button here and you can track the location of your phone. And what it's gonna do is it's going to show you the exact location of the phone in the map right here. And the best part is this entire maps is from Google Maps. So the location tracking is going to be super accurate. So you use this option to track location. It's gonna show you exactly where the phone is on the map. And then you can go and get your phone, but you'll get the exact location. Now, the other thing you can do is you can erase the data of the phone remotely. If I click this right now, it's gonna ask me for a confirmation and it's going to wipe everything out from my device. And sometimes that's good to have just in case you're scared if your phone has a lot of sensitive data. Now, what I recommend you do is before you erase data, remotely back it up. This is the best part with this interface, it's logical. So you can back it up first and then you can delete it. The backed up data is gonna to go to the cloud. So the person that has your phone is not gonna have access to that. And then you can erase the phone and now that person has nothing. But when you get your phone back, you can restore the backup from the Samsung account. So incredibly logical situation here. You can also lock and unlock your phone. By default, I would just click lock. So if somebody got your phone, it was unlocked and they're using it, you can click lock, it's gonna lock them out. They're not gonna be able to go back inside unless they know your pin number or your password. You can also, if you think the phone is close by, maybe it's under a table or something, you lost it, or maybe just fell somewhere, you cannot see it, you can have that phone actually ring itself so you can identify its location by sound. And another cool feature is the retrieve messages and calls feature. So let's say you lost your phone, but you're still wondering, who called me and who messaged me? Who knows, maybe when you lost your phone, you might have been in an emergency situation where you were waiting on a response from somebody. So you can retrieve calls and messages right from here in case you need to. And finally, from this control panel, you can click this button and you can extend the battery life of your phone, which will help you because let's say you're tracking your phone. But let's say you look up here and your battery life is like 12%. You wanna click this button and that's gonna extend the battery life so you can track that phone for longer before you're actually able to go get it physically. So that's basically what we are looking at here, this powerful menu, the Find My Mobile system for your Samsung phone. Just enable it, write that URL down. If you ever lose it or if it ever gets stolen, you are able to track it and do all these nice things with the control panel. Fantastic feature. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know for now, guys. Have a fantastic day.